Saint X here, currently playing some Gravity Rush 2. I had figured I might want to put one more video up before I decide to record some open beta footage of the city of Final Fantasy NT, so let's not delay this any further, let's cut straight to that gameplay. Oh wow. I thought I was just watching an introduction or something like that. No, guess not. How do you go? Skip this as well. skippable opening credits but looks more like it's something you had to do first before we get into the main game. So we're descending. <clears throat> descending into ruins, descending into something Something that was left behind. Oh, first person now. Follow the miner. Or, or bulges. I forgot what they were called. Those like the weak spots on those shadow creatures in the first one. Yeah, can't jump. Automatic jump right there. Right, and now we're evacuating. No, oh, guess they're evacuating, and I'm just uh, following this guy. They're evacuating. We're not. Are we still going to go through with this? I think so. 
fatto Vai. I wasn't expected. I thought I was playing as a different character. becoming uncharted <laughs> I mean not exactly like uncharted but I'm just running away from uh, what a falling crumbling ancient more just an ancient architecture just crumbling Interactive comic. You've both been nothing but trouble since you showed up. You didn't check the gravel levels, did you? No, nah, we're really sorry about that. Two lost craft suits. Our rules demand we always pay our debts. Sorry, doesn't cover our losses. Hunger doesn't either. Lisa, wait. Can we at least have dinner first? No, and don't bother complaining. Oh, I can't take it. I shouldn't even have. I shouldn't even have to care about gravity. The nonsense about shifting gravity again. Get back down to Earth. We're off. Set course for Banga. How did we end up like this? Our trouble started with the incident at No Kirillion. We were pulled into a horrific gravity storm and drifted through the rift plains. When we woke, we were with the boat people who worked with the who worked, who worked the city stolen by the storm for war. Their leader, leader, their leader, Lisa, treated us like her slaves. The days when I was Hexville's gravity queen seemed so long ago. I hadn't seen the other gravity shifter, Raven, or my partner, Dusty, since. All I had left was an empty stomach. Well, at least that kind of covers uh, the events between this and uh, the first gravity rush. Uh, 
That also explains why she doesn't have her gravity powers. Settlement. Lisa? Lisa, is something up? I thought we had today off. Also, Convey a message to Misai for me. Make sure the fleet has enough spare gravitational power. Oh, yeah. Sure, but uh, why do I have to go? I'm exhausted from a hard day's work at the mining site and. New as it might be, you remember our rules. Right, all debts must be uh, repaid, and a uh, lazy worker is a hungry worker. Deliver the message uh, when you're done, report back to me. You don't pull your weight, you lose your weight when we stop feeding you, got it? You got it! By the way, have you seen Sessie around here? Sessie? No, I'm not sure what she could be. If you do, tell her she better remember to look after the livestock. Silly. Sure, I'll let her know. Lisa sure is rough with her people. Oh, wow. Well. Deliver the message to Masai. Oh, wow. Well. So, no start menu or anything like that? Just straight into the game? First, uh, guess we better talk to this guy and find where, find where. Somewhere, let's find out where Misai is. Oh, square to talk. Uh, X. Hey, uh, you making yourself useful around here? Of course, I do everything Misa asks, and pull my weight. In fact, right now I'm trying to find Misai for her. Oh. He sighs over prepping the mining boat. Hmm. Oh, ew. What? Getting a little ripe there. Smell like one of our animals. Maybe you should take a bath. Oh, come on. What do you expect? I'm forced to sleep in the bird coop. Where all the birds poop. Sorry. <laughs> and I just took a bath last night. Uh, so she's on the boat or something? But where's the boat? Or at least he, he says she's on the boat. But what are those... More, oh, uh, <laughs> what am I trying to say here? <laughs> Somewhere else. What will the other NPCs tell me? Probably the same thing or she'll probably be, probably be somewhere else. Blah. Let's see. Two more NPCs to talk to. Sai? He's probably getting uh, the money boat ready. Yeah, I thought Sai was a girl. He's a hard worker for a uh, youngin. Maybe a bit rough, but you can't question his dedication. He might still be green at all this, but pay close attention to Lisa and remember our rules. A lazy worker is a hungry worker. Got it. Right. Still at the boat. The boat. And the boat. Am I gonna find the boat, or do I have to talk to every NPC about Misai's whereabouts? Information shown in the storm. It's probably something different. Sun must be around here somewhere, she said to herself. Jump. Okay, you might tell me the same thing as well. He's sigh, huh? He's usually over at the mining boat. He's obsessed with mining, so he's always tinkering on that thing. Thanks, I'll just head on over to that mining boat then. I was hoping to get the day off, but Lisa got on my case. 
You better listen to her. Remember, a lazy worker is a hungry worker. I know. Jeez. So I had to talk to three people just to <laughs> confirm three times that he was on the boats. Okay. Right. Gotta do a bit of platforming. Right here. There's Miss Sai. He's got a uh, girl behind him. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah? What do you want? Come tell me one of your uh, tall t tales. Come to tell me one of your tall tales. Tall tales? I heard that whole spiel about being able to control gravity. Says you might fall for your stories, but I won't. Miss Sai? Don't be so mean to Cat. I'm not lying. If you don't want to believe me, that's your problem. I just came here to, uh, sorry. I just came here to convey a message from Lisa. She wanted you to check the fleet's gravitational energy. Their message conveyed. Tell her to leave it to me. I'll double check the levels and top them off. Who knew delivering a simple message would be such a hassle? Oh, I almost forgot. Lisa had a message. For you too, Sessie. Don't forget to take care of the livestock. Oh no, I forgot. I need to get over there fast. Sessie, remember to focus and do a good job. Guess that's my cue to take off. Hold it. What? I conveyed the message. What more do you want? Before you head back to Lisa, let the workers on the wind, uh, windmill boat know they uh, need to check the fuel supply. Isn't that supposed to be your job? Just tell him. I'm already up to my neck in work. Alright, alright. I'm going. <laughs> okay, where was that windmill parked? Windmill park. That boat's parked. Over there. Information. Just dropping down from there. Hmm. Do I talk to you now? Hola. Wow, did you just see Ola? I've got a message from Isai. He wanted you to check the windmill boat's fuel supplies. Hmm? hmm? Oh yeah, I'm s uh, I suppose it's getting around that time again. Better get to work. Wouldn't want to get Miss Sai fired up. Hey, uh, is he always that high strung? He's just serious about his work. Sure, he's a little rough around the edges, but once he warms up to you, he's an alright guy. Hmm, I see. So what I don't see is Messiah ever warming up to me. Thanks for the tip. <laughs> that finishes off my chores. Better report to Lisa, wherever she might be. Over there. That's how you roll. Sissy. Sissy? One more time. How did you not notice the livestock running away? I'm sorry, Lisa. I'm not asking for apologies. I'm asking for reasons. Well, well. Uh, uh, I was straightening my doll's clothes, and when I looked up, the animals were gone. Not a great time, but here goes. Hey, uh, did you... I mean, uh, sorry. Hey, uh, did I... I did what you asked. 
So I'm here to report in. Fine. Here's the provision. Rest up for tomorrow. Right. Thank you. CC was in tears. I hope she was okay. Dot dot dot. <laughs> oh come on. You're already asleep? And in my bed too? The only thing you're good at is getting out of work. And I was hoping to get you, uh, get you, give you half of my bread. Huh? What? Uh, how's a person supposed to sleep in a shed of, shed full of ducks and those swan boxes? Episode one, sad angel. Get up. Hi. Have you seen CC? She's gone missing. Haven't seen her since. Lisa dressed her down about the livestock. Dressed her down. I don't think she came home last night. Lisa told me Ceci was just blown off steam and leave her, uh, and to leave her be. Really? It sounds kind of cold of Lisa. It is her daughter. Well, technically she's not Lisa's daughter. It's complicated. Complicated how? All right. Uh, Cece's a uh, drift rat, drift rat like us. One of the storms dropped her here. Right. Lisa felt sorry for her and took her in. Treated her like a daughter ever since. I see. Well, we can't just leave her out there. Sid, let's split up and look for her. Search. <laughs> Got it. Find CC. Guess I better ask around. Oh, sorry. Oh. It's about to walk off that bridge. Yep. And there's Lisa. Cece's whereabouts. Lisa, do you have any idea where Cece might be? No, but she'll be back. Just leave her be. You're not worried? Worrying doesn't solve anything and I don't have time for coddling. Our job is to work hard and repair debts. That's her way of life. Wow. Harsh. Come on, Sessie, where are you? Cece. <laughs> Keep thinking it's Sessie. Who else do I ask? Is there anybody else to even ask? It's not like there are many places to go here. Nope. See a uh, dialogue bubble thing up there? Guess a little kid might have seen her. Well, it's not just a floating town. There's at least that piece of uh, land that's floating right there to go to. Let's see. Sage better really be looking for her. Cece, I saw her in the bird coop yesterday, but I haven't seen her today. Do you know anywhere she might go? Are you going to tell Lisa? No, it'll be our secret. Okay, well, Cece sometimes goes over to the gravel pit. That's where the gravity storm first dropped her. The gravel pit. Got it. Thanks for your help. Ah, uh, yep. That place. Is that her up there peeking? Cece. Catch Cece. where me and Sid first landed here? Hexville must be so far away. And without Dusty, I can't even shift gravity. If I had to drift here, why did I have to end up with Sid? Leather? I hope Raven's all right. Where could she have gone? Mm. Hmm. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. 
Raven and Dusty can fend for themselves. I'm sure they're fine wherever they are. And I had to skip over some dialogue right there. For now, I just need to concentrate on fighting Cece. Don't double tap so much. Wow. Some kind of thing in the center. Platform. Oh, there she is. Running into that cave. Cece's faster than she looks. I can barely keep up. But she kind of had a head start. Could just jump over this and just... <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Okay, let's see if I can make this jump. I'm gonna have to. Another jump. Oh, oh. Guess she can't even grab ledges. Oh, wow. Little pit hole or whatever. Oh, wow. Careful. Cece, where are you going? Oh, it sure got dark all of a sudden. She must be in trouble. Oh. Okay, what do I go next? Up out there. Just gonna jump off from here. to the uh, game. We get CC back. CC must be up this way. Okay. Better make this jump. Of course I'm gonna make this jump. She jumps pretty high. Okay. CC Perfect timing. You up to this? Of course, as long as Dusty is. Meow. Alright, Dusty, you know what to do. You can pull it away from Sessie and Sid. See some. Oh, wait, did I press it in time? Oh, nope. <laughs> Time that right. Gotta kick the rock and then I gotta hit, hit that uh, glowing ball. Time to finish it. Let's see, we've managed to weaken a powerful enemy. You have a chance to finish them off by pressing the touchpad button. The touchpad button display is touchpad. Finish it. <laughs>
Without seeing my power to control gravity back, I escaped that bind. But when the gravity storm, fa uh, storm faded and the settlement returned from evacuating. Exclamation point. Exclamation point. Uh oh. Lisa doesn't look happy. Um, hey, uh, Lisa? We should be thanking Sessie. Sessie found Dusty and with Dusty I... Ah! Sessie. Sessie. Sissy. There won't always be someone to help you. You need to learn to watch out for yourself. I'm... sorry. Lisa just, uh, Lisa just doesn't want to go through that same tragedy again. Again? Girl. Ah. I mean, cat. I apologize for thinking you were just lying about your past. Thank you for bringing Cece back. Oh, uh, well, no worries. Oh well, you can use the spare room in my airboat from now on. Now you don't have to sleep on crates. I mean, you can leave that other guy to sleep on the crates, but you can sleep in my spare room from now on. <laughs> awesome, no more sleeping with ducks for me. Also, no more crates as well. Now about your partner. He'll be out of action for a while with that injury. My partner, you mean Sid? He was hurt that bad? When someone goes down, it's up to their partner to pick up the slack. What? Good luck, partner. With her apology and generosity, I discovered that the tough exterior wasn't all there was to Lisa. However, it was still a large part that, uh, thanks to Sid out of, uh, being out of commission, I would be pulling double duty. <laughs> What's Sid doing? I think that's her outfit. Huh? My clothes are as good as new. Did Sid do this for me? Yes, now. I guess so, I wouldn't have expected that of him. Out of him. My clothes are back. You're back. Things are looking up. What do you say, Dusty? Should we go work out the kinks? Yes, now. I should try floating first. Hard one to float. No people nearby, right? Yep, yep. <laughs> I had a feeling that would happen. Every time I'm near someone, someone floats. One more time. Oh! Turn to the ground. Probably shouldn't be near people when you do that. Now I can really get around the settlement. Stop measure at the, at the uh, designated location. Now that I can shift gravity. Can you see that? Ah, wait a minute. That one's behind me, right? Up. Stop. Gravity shifting. Pressing R1 will cause cat to float. A floating a target marker will appear on the screen. While floating in the blue target marker with uh, the right stick or by tilting the controller when, and, uh, and then press R1 to fall t forward towards the blue marker. Press R1 again to stop falling and float here. You can press R1 anytime to return to normal gravity. R1 to float or stop midair or fall forward. L1 to revert to normal gravity. Okay, yeah. Enough reading. Nope. It's Sassy, I wonder what she's up to. Just wanted to stop my phone. Hey, Cece. Cece, how do you like my new clothes? Those are the clothes we found you in when you first dropped here. See, that's a bit of Spanish right there. Yeah, they were beaten up pretty bad, but Sid mended them for me. 
bit of Japanese. Sid did a great job patching him up. Yeah, who knew he had it in him? Cad, you've got an amazing power. Not to mention you're always so positive and so strong. Thanks to you, Cece. Me? But I haven't done anything. What are you talking about? You're the reason I got my power back. If you hadn't done Dusty and taken care of him, I might have never seen him again. Yes, ma'am. You're welcome, cats. And you too, Dusty. Stop me there at the designated location. I don't want to do it about people. Okay. Load in place. Where are you? Find the person who called you. Where is he then? Right up here. For the moment, I have unlimited uh, unlimited use of the gravity powers until they uh, give me the uh, meter for the gravity stuff. Do I go find this person? Oh, can't land. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Drop down and talk to Gawan. Conversation with Gawan. With all that flying and falling, you've got yourself a nifty power there. And those clothes look right fancy. They suit you. <laughs> yep, it feels like I'm back to my real self again. Guess I should uh, practice a little more to remember how it works. Don't push yourself too hard. Wouldn't want you to be sore for your mining shift. That's something else I gotta do. Maybe I should head over to the windmill bolt. Through the windmill boat. That's not that specific. It's me, Sai. I wonder what he'll say when he sees me now. <laughs> Guess the biggest skeptic now turned into a believer. Conversation with me, Sai. Hey, Misai, how's it hanging? Don't go acting all hot cause, uh, just because you're some fancy gravity shifter. I'm not acting hot, but you gotta admit it's cool. That's exactly what I'm talking about. And that partner of yours. Playing up the whole injury thing to get out of work. He's not playing it up. Why does Masai always have to be such a downer? Okay, yeah. Hmm, maybe I should go practice where there are no people. Head further back into the gravel pit and start training. Place to practice. Let's see what we're practicing. Gravity shift. The, uh, should gravity fall to the rock's face? Oops. Okay, time to start shifting and get back to the ground. Gems. Because the ones that restore the uh, meter. Yep, and there's the meter. Gravity gauge and energy gems. When your gravity gauge runs out of energy, you can no longer control gravity. Energy will recover naturally over time as long as you aren't using any gravity powers. What about the gems? You can also recover your gravity gauge's energy by collecting energy gems. Shifting gravity and falling to a wall, you can move with L and 
jump with an extra evade to evade, evade with R2, or perform any other actions you could if you were on the ground. Of course, I'm about to fall right there. Head towards the marker. Be the last one. I wonder if I can land on that narrow spot right there. Head towards the marker. Navigation markers. If something is obstructing your view of a navigation marker, the marker's visual will change to indicate that. Shift gravity to get, to get around the obstacle and continue towards your destination. So, so what do I do? Let's go around the rock. Jump right there. Just recover. Oh, but I'm supposed to land right there. I'm a little nervous, but I should be okay. Played the gravity control tutorial? No. Just got finished. Need to find Sid and thank him, uh, thank him for, <laughs> for fixing my claws. Jeez, why is that so hard to say? Okay. That was quick. And now uh, there's a limit to how much I can do this. Motion sensor. You can adjust the camera angle while shifting gravity by tilting the controller. Motion sensor sensitivity. Uh, by tilting the controller. Motion sensor sensitivity can be adjusted by pressing options and selecting system. If you set the sensitivity to zero, you can turn off the effect of the motion sensor. Okay. I guess I have to look around the settlements. Find Sid. Where exactly do I need to find him? Oh, there he is. Flirting with girls. 